Okay, so is that what has you in this chipper mood? Because I'm going to be honest with you. You coming with this real heavy, flirty energy right now. What's the deal with that? I'm a flirt. See you walk up in the club. I'm a flirt. That's how you feel. That's how you feel. <laughs> no, but seriously, what what's the deal with that? He confessed it to me, but he didn't want it out on there. He didn't want a oh, lot. Oh, wait, know? wait. Oh, I'm sorry. So hold on. Your story was he was the one that did it. My dad, yeah. Oh, I don't. Okay, so I I hear so many stories. So he didn't like that. So what did he say to you? I feel. Like, wow, okay. Foot and mouth. Foot and mouth syndrome sometimes. <laughs> it happens. Trust me, it happens out here. Yeah. My people love to point it out when I do it. Too. What's up, YouTube? Back in the lab with KD for the summertime. And this time, I got my hitters with me. If you want to get this work, hit up at KD with the muscle on Instagram. Now, back to the content. What's up, YouTube? Atlanta Street Interviews out here with the update. So, guys, I don't think I posted the last update I did with her, but... Um, we're, we're out here again, so so first and foremost, you know, it's the day after Father's Day. How are you this morning? Oh, sorry. Happy belated Father's Day. No doubt, no doubt, no doubt, no doubt, no doubt. Uh, how are you, though? How are you this morning? It's like a horrible person, sorry. Um, hope you enjoyed your day. Anywho, so y'all, it's me. So listen, how are you? I'm doing better. I just signed up for these classes. So, so real quick, start. so the, the, the last thing that we talked about was you had actually um because they didn't see the the update i you, did go back to my mom's house not to cut you off how's everything been though um i've been doing better and i mean the reason why i asked is because um you know after the interview for a few days i was seeing you out there on the block at gateway um you was out there with shay right um jeremiah oh, jeremiah guess what oh y'all sorry i freaking went to the school and i registered he told me yeah he told me you registered for uh, for the school, so congrats on that. We'll talk about that in a second as well. Um, but I, I, you know, I, I was, you know, I passed by there every day, and I started to not see you out there. And so I was asking him, like, "Hey, what happened, to old girl?" And he was like, "I don't know. I just she one day she wasn't here, or whatever." So tell us what happened. You was on the block one day, and then you wasn't. What happened? I pretty much, thank God, um, I went back to my family's house for like a week or so. So and, like your mom? Mm -hmm. Okay, so it's kind of like a big deal. That's like because th that was this moment right here where where you tried to call your mom and she didn't pick up and this look that you had right here. Hello? Please leave your message. Wait, mm. one more time, one more time. Yeah, that's fine. See, I'm like trying. Oh. So, I can see the frustration, feel the energy, feel the frustrated energy that you have. What is it? Tell me. Tell me what you're feeling. Yeah, so, so, so I guess eventually you got in touch with her? Yeah. Okay, and so what happened? I yeah. did go back. And I left again because, you know, we argue. We're like yin and yang. Not really, but... Um, so... I'm actually getting some new glasses soon, and I'm actually like doing better. Like I'm about to take these classes, and then I get paid for them, so that I can get a house or apartment or whatever. Okay, okay. Yeah. So, so, so when I pulled up, you was in a pretty good mood. I was. What is going on? Why are you in such a good mood? Well, you're such an upbeat mood. My day is just going so good, so swell. What's going so swell about it? It's just a great day to be alive. Well, no, you gotta give us more than that. Honestly, like I'm doing better, and <laughs> so I'm gonna ask, right? Just because I'm me, and I have to ask, right? So, is it any drugs? Is it any type of, you know, hey, we might have? I haven't even been vaping. 
Well, I have vape, but like not really. I was about I just to say, gave my vape the... away yesterday or this morning. You gave your vape away? Yeah, I don't know. No same. young ladies in their twenties to do that. They freak out if they lose that vape, boy. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so is that what has you in this chipper mood? Because I'm gonna be honest with you, you coming with this real heavy flirty energy right now. What's the deal with that? I'm a flirt. You walk up in the club, I'm a flirt. That's how you feel. That's how you feel. <laughs> no, but seriously, what what's the deal with that? Like, like what's what's going on? Like, I'm, I'm just me and you, better. me and you have been in each other's presence several times, but this is the first time you're giving me this eye. You're giving me this energy. What's up? Like, I want to know. Like, what's what's why? What's the deal with that? I'm saying like, I'm just grateful. I have a new opportunity in front of me that I'm not gonna miss. And so what is it you going to what is it going to school for what? To be a leadership for leadership, so basically for administration. So front like front desk for a Okay. Lady. Okay. Hey y'all. <laughs> so listen, I ain't gonna lie, right? I love the energy. I love the energy. I'm just I'm just trying to figure out where it comes from because there's other times where I've seen you, right? Where I might have rolled by something like that and I could tell that you was maybe in a bad mood, something like that. Well, I just had to snap back. You know, sometimes when life is beating you up so many times, you feel like, damn, like, I can't catch a break. Right. But then you got to realize there's still a lot of stuff to be grateful for. And that's on God. So that's that. Well, that's so true. It is. It really is so true. So, so is that is that all that is that this is right now? Yeah, it's a reality check for myself, basically. Like. Okay, so I know that you had went back with your mom and, and it didn't work out or whatever. Um, have y'all spoken since then? Um, I actually did get a new phone. It's a little trap phone for now. But I'm grateful to have a phone that's on. So, and, um, I don't know. Well, I, I asked, have y'all spoken since then? Um, no, but, but I might call her. Okay, okay. So, it's not like you won't speak to with her or nothing yeah. like that. Okay. Okay, um, did she see any of these videos? My brother has. And my dad, because my brother, my dad had got mad. Why'd he get mad? That I had put his, his business out on his, on, on YouTube. I don't remember, what then. was it, what was it that, because I don't remember you, you hardly saying anything about your dad. I thought it was mostly about your mom. You know, the first interview when I had said I was molested, he got mad. And he texted my brother, was like, why? I don't know. Oh wait, so he did, did, he, did, he, did he not know that? No what? Um, that you that that had happened to you? No, he t he confessed it to me, but he didn't want it out on there. He didn't want a oh, lot. Oh you know? wait, wait. Oh, I'm sorry. So hold on. Your story was he was the one that did it. My dad, yeah. Oh, I don't. Okay, so I I hear so many stories. So he didn't like that. So what did he say to you? What's going on, brother? Um. He didn't say nothing to me because I didn't speak to him. But he, my brother, he told my brother, and he was mad. Well, not my brother, but like uh, whatever. Anywho, um, that's not what I want to focus on right now. Well, yeah, no, I'm sorry for even listen honestly because I even said the thing about Father's Day and everything else, and I was just gonna ask, did you talk to your dad Father's Day? But I feel like wow, okay, foot and mouth. Foot and mouth syndrome sometimes <laughs> it happens. Trust me, it happens out here. Yeah. My people love to point it out when I do it too. And I normally will toes, still post ladies it. Ladies and gentlemen, get yourselves your toes. You say what? What'd you say? No. I'm being silly. Yeah, you're being extra silly. That's what I'm trying to figure I'm out. Happy, like I'm just a happy person. Like if you know me overall, like in general, I'm a happy. Just a happy person, person huh? Man. I mean, do you have like a boyfriend out here or something, or like is that what's going on? Uh, like I might get one. Well, I was just trying to figure out, like, because sometimes when women are in, like, a good mood and stuff, mm -hmm. they have a new romantic interest, stuff like that. So is it anything like that, or you just in just a randomly good mood? Yeah. Uh-uh. No. Come on. I am. Come on out with it. Come on out with it. Come on. Come on. I got somebody blessed me with a frontal, so that's it. Like, you know. I usually wear wigs. Somebody give me a frontal. You got a frontal? Yeah. So you about to be rocking that? <laughs> I know that when girls get their hair done, like that's that is kind of a thing that puts they them in a good mood like, and stuff you like know, that. They're the prettiest woman in the world. Like, what the heck? I could dig that. Did you ever get a chance to read the comments and stuff on that video? Sometimes, yeah, some of them I did. Uh, everybody agrees that you have these big, beautiful lips. 
<laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> Just know if y'all cash at me, because I have to take it there, I didn't get none of it. Zero. Nada. And it's okay. Why not? Because that's my old cash That's what? That was my old cash app. Do you have a new one? No, I could make one, but I'll make one. Okay. And I'm gonna drop it in the description in, in the comment section. You're driving the comment section? Yeah. All right, all right. Well, yeah, listen. I, to. I can't make nobody do nothing. Well, listen. I, I I think your story was awesome just because you were captured. I for, I forgot about the whole thing about you, Dad. Huh? No, I was gonna say you captured. I think you captured the heart of the audience when it came to, especially when you was trying to reach out to your mom, mm -hmm. and that whole deal, you know. And so glad to hear that you guys did get back in touch, and you know you tried. <laughs> you tried. We tried, right? Yeah, I told you. Well, it be like that. That's what I'm trying to figure out. Like, so you're saying that there's no drugs, no nothing like that, because no, being out I here. Have once in a, I have before popped the Percocet. I have Percocet, but it was fun. But okay. I don't just, I'm not out here just. Just like wilding. Yeah, you don't seem like it. I'm just trying to figure out where this upper, chipper, hyper mood is coming from. Like, it, it's, it's different. That's why I was like, you know what? Let's go ahead and do the interview. Let's do it. So, all right, well, listen, we appreciate you. All right, we definitely. And I met Shamar. I saw him on your video too. I met him before when I was out and about. <laughs> well, One day I was out going to this lounge and I saw Shamar and we took a picture. You took a picture? Hold on. So let's see your picture pose. <laughs> all right, all right. Shout out to Shamar, man. Shout out to Shamar. All right, and listen, like I say, we really appreciate you taking the time asking all of our questions. If anybody out there did want to reach out, help, or donate, you have a way they could do that? They have social media, cash app, anything like that? Mm, my Instagram. My Instagram. Okay. What is it? <laughs> what is it again? Um, it is a brain fart. It is. I'm what are you thinking about? What I, is going I, I had on? To, I had to no, think. no, no. You gotta you gotta come on now. Come on now. What is what is happening in that brain? It's tell the truth. Oh my gosh. Okay, it's underscore. She is underscore worthy. Okay. All right. Well, like I say, we always appreciate you. I'm definitely wishing them but the best, okay? All right. You make sure you have a good one, sweetie. <laughs>